Okay, Assalamualaikum and good afternoon, uh, everybody. So today we are going to uh, so we're going to study about the application of Laplace transform. Okay. So we did study what is Laplace transform look like, and we did apply the we did uh, uh, do some assignment uh, sorry uh, the tutorial okay so today we work on the application so uh, our application today we cover the uh, two application is a mass string and uh, the circuit okay. uh, a spring okay it's the same with almost the same with the previous uh, equation but last time we did uh, it uh, through uh, ODE okay uh, we, we did it through the ODE but today we are going to work uh, with the um, uh, last plus Go, so a spring is stretch one stretched 1.22 meter by a weight of 4.9 newton so the medium resists uh, the motion of the object with a damping force of two uh, v, I mean uh, two time of the velocity. Where the v is the velocity, find the displacement of the object as a function of the time. If y zero equal to one and dy dt equal to zero, when t zero by the plus transform. Okay, so uh, this equation we did uh, recognize it. Okay, so by using uh, Newton second law, uh, we have m y double dash uh, plus uh, c y dash plus k y equal to zero. So this one is uh, the combination of force. Okay, so this one is from the acceleration. Uh, uh, this one is uh, from the velocity and this is uh, the damping force okay so if we uh, replace this m c k so you first of all if you make c c is equal to 2 c is a uh, 2 time of the velocity and then m is uh, that's the mass so you can see that uh, weight is equal to uh, 4.9 this is already explained in the previous in the tutorial and the acceleration due to the gravity is uh, 9.8 so we got mass is equal to 0. Uh, 4.9 divided by 9.8 so it's 0. 0.5 kilogram so this constant k is found from the fact that the springs the spring stretch 1.122 uh, meter for a force of 4.9 uh, newton this from hook law we can s see that uh, from hook law uh, force is equal to uh, the damping force uh, multiplied with uh, the displacement okay uh, the damping force uh, sorry the force is equal to the coefficient of the damping multiplied with uh, the dis displacement of the stretch so in the, in our case uh, the force is known uh, the stretch or replacement is known so we can calculate k okay. and k is equal to uh, 4 newton per meter this means that the differential equation can be solved by 0 0.5 multiplied with y double dash plus 2 y dash plus 4 y equal to 0 so if we uh, move this uh, 1.2 so then become 4 and it become 8 equal to so we may get uh, something like this okay so we got this is 1.2 y double dash plus 2 y dash plus 4 y this is equal to zero. So we get 
add uh, two here, so it become this one. So one. I mean, this is y dash double dash plus two multiplied by two is four dash plus four multiplied by two is eight y equal to zero. Okay. So, uh, clear the refraction and denote the derivation by y dash and y double dash and y dash. The reference variable equation become uh, y dash double dash plus y uh, 4y dash plus 8y equal to 0. So, from here we can, what can we do this time? We will uh, um, uh, make both sides okay, with the Laplace transform. Okay, so with Laplace transform. This also Laplace transform. Okay, so then you will get uh, Laplace transform of. Okay, so we could get the Laplace of y double dash plus Laplace transform of y dash plus a l y mean Laplace of y equal to zero. Okay, and then how about this uh, Laplace y double dash is equal to one. So Laplace double dash it will be equal to. 